What's up guys, JojoBraced here. Uh, we will have another uh, JojoBra tutorial in this video. Uh, we will be uh, graphing the function uh, g of x equals 4x plus 5 all over x plus 1 and then uh, determine the x and y intercepts and lastly we will draw the uh, asymptotes of the function. Okay, so first off we have g of x equals 4x plus 5. Uh, now I use the uh, parenthesis because I'm going to divide the entire expression by x plus 1. So divided by x plus 1. By the way, divided uh, the division symbol there is slash. So we press the enter key, finalize our graph. Next, we will be uh, determining the x and y intercepts. I think for the y intercept, it's clear that it's 0, 5, so we can just type 0, 5. But for the uh, x intercept, I think it's better if you use the intersect tool. So we intersect the graph and the x axis. We just click on the intersection, and there goes our point. Next, we will be... Uh, now, what if I want to show the coordinates of the point instead of the names or the labels? So I can just right-click and then select Settings. And then from the Basic tab, choose value from the show label drop down box and then I can also uh, show the coordinates of this point. Okay. Next I won't be needing the grid so I can just click on the graphics view and then clear the grid. So what do you think is the asymptote of the function? From here, from the equation, we know that uh, the asymptote, the vertical asymptote is uh, x equals negative 1. So you equate this by uh, 0, x plus 1 equals 0. The uh, vertical asymptote is x equals negative 1. Okay. And we don't want to show the label. We just uh, right click on the line and select show label. So as you, you can see the label here disappeared. What's the horizontal asymptote? From here that's 4x over x so it's 4 meaning the uh, horizontal asymptote is y equals 4. Now since the horizontal asymptotes and asymptote and the uh, vertical asymptote is not part of the graph, I can make this maybe gray. I want this to be gray and at the same time dashed. So I can choose the, the line style here and then I can choose dashed and also here dashed. So if you remember last time we uh, labeled the graph, we can uh, label the graph here. We have, we will use LaTeX. So for fraction, we have g of x equals, now if you don't want to type, you can search for the object here. Go to advanced and then select or select the GeoGebra icon. This is the function G, so you can just select G. You don't want to type the uh, text. Also, uh, I can change the color of the text to green. Oh, sorry. I should choose the move tool first. Then, yeah, I 
choose the move tool, select the text, and then select the color gate. And if I want to change the size, I want it a bit bigger, I choose medium. Okay, so that's it. That's our short tutorial for the uh, graphing functions. Um, we will learn about LaTeX data, how to write uh, functions in LaTeX, and of course, other uh, more complicated uh, LaTeX commands. That's it. Uh, I hope you enjoyed this, tutor this uh, tutorial. I would like to invite you to subscribe to my channel. I'll see you in the next video.